Why well, hello there and welcome back to that spitting guy. Last time we unearthed a chest, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, there it is. So what's in there? Woohoo, rupees. Because I totally need those. So, in order to continue, we want to go across... Sorry, I was just checking something because there is a distinct absence of spiders in the Master Quest. How to deal with these guys is... Wah! The best thing you can do is ch stand just right there. And mess it up. So you kind of wanna slay them a little. I remember this being less gruesome. Oh wait, these are not your normal Deku scrubs. These are actually the advanced ones. So let's see, we have two torches that we can probably want to incinerate. Huh. How would we go about that? Can I bring fire? Through the door. Yes, I can! In the original um, version of this game, you never needed to do that, I don't think. So it's no surprise that I don't know. The puzzle in this room was instead using the slingshot to sh shoot an eye switch above the door. Also, the deco scrub was one of the normal ones, the level 1 once, if you want to call it that. Um. Ooh, wow. Well, don't expect too great things from... Oh, what? Let me check the water real quick. In the original version, there was a switch on the water that made the water lower. Yeah, good job. In this version, not so much. The unfortunate thing about this version is that sometimes there's a switch, a crystal switch that you, hit, you have to hit with something half buried in the wall and you pretty much can't see it. So, one thing is obvious though. Aha! You can't just duck under it. And pass the soul. Hopefully. Anything else of interest? Other than this obvious chest. Oh. Shut up, plant. No one's talking to you. We can't get this chest yet. Because it's under this block. In the original version, there was a block here that could be pushed around to get up to the ledge. In this version, you can just go there by normal 
However, you can get the chest that is under that block. We have to come back here later. Ah, yeah, come on. Same goes for you. Take your strap. Come here. Dang. I remember these enemies from not this game because I never fight them in this game. Normally. On the original version of this game. Oh, well, at least I get a couple of nuts out of it. Come, there's more of you. There. Well, that's bad. I sniped that one right above my head. I am just awesome like that. So, this is the entrance, and seems like there's not a whole lot. Else. Wait, did it? They changed the map of this place, the layout, didn't they? Yeah, one god scapula. Oh well. Um. Well, that's interesting. I guess. No link. Ooh, he dropped three hearts. Get him, Link. Get him. We want hearts. Eat the hearts of the enemy of your enemies. You become stronger. That's how this works. Hmm. These are gravestones, aren't they? My, you are a plant? Go away, plant. Hmm. Are you gonna... Stay on? No. Well, first things first, how about the. Uh, check out this top left room. How about we don't? Let me destroy this X first because I do not want to play with. the spiders with two legs in this kind of env environment. Emily, what are you doing? Why don't you cut the stupid head of the stupid plant off? Also, it's kind of out of bounds, isn't it? Out of bounds, a place where dream where Link can only dream to go. Oh, can he actually go there? Anyway, there's a school to learn up there. Ah, I see. This place wasn't part of the map. It was secreted and hidden away. Not that this helps a whole lot, because in the original version it was just a normal room. But nice that they added hidden rooms. It did show up on the map. Shoot already, Link. This is getting a real problem. Oh well. There is one more spider up that we kind of want to burn. So, and if we go in that direction, we should be back in the first room of the basement. 
Yes, hello? Yeah. Oh, dang. It's one of them. You hit the monks and you talk to them. And they sell you stuff for way too many rupees. They are a thing. So, next on our agenda is... Well, shut up, Navi. We know that it's a block that we can't push. <sighs> and I can't even fast forward the thing. And you can also not deactivate it. The Nintendo. How about... An option to turn the tutorial mode off. This doesn't necessarily go for Ocarina of Time so much, because Navi eventually will shut off and not give you any more redundant hints. However, there's a certain lady in Skyward Sword um, that does not shut up so much. So, yeah. With grabbable crop, the uh, blocks. Wow, that's a tight, tight limit. Tiny, tiny, a tight limit. Yes. Let's try this then. Well, the belly worked. But it worked. Get some heart refreshers. Didn't miss any treasure, except for that one which I can't get yet. Yeah, here. So. Um. I think we've got a hint this time in this game. How to deal with these guys. The correct order can only be found in the original game. Or so I thought. My. Well, there's not too many options, but they can be. I didn't see the solution anywhere. Okay, middle one is not first. Seems unlikely that this would be the correct combination. No. For stuff like this. Just alternate the ones that are to be first. Ah, that's a correct combination. So we could chase after him, but really he'll just come to us if he stepped on his bed. <laughs> I didn't know your secret, I was guessing a couple times. Administer the Coupe de Grasse. Right. You have done the right thing, soldier! <laughs> anyway... It's time for our first boss! My, how exciting! The interesting thing about this boss room is... It's so glitched out it can lead directly to the final boss. <laughs> Ha 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 ha! 
So, let's have a look at her. Hello! Hello! Don't ask me, that's kind of a reference to the boss in the... that slime boss in... In... <laughs> Link's Awakening, by the way! I made this one look a lot easier than it actually is. <laughs> not that it is hard in the first place, but it's not supposed to be this easy. But yeah, to explain the glitch I just used, well, I don't know if it's really a glitch, but I made a jumping slash, which is double damage with my sword. And then crouch stabbed. Which gives me that double damage from the jump slash every single time. However, if you want to warp to the boss room, you have to make sure that the boss and you die on the same frame. A frame is a fraction of a second. <laughs> so go figure. If you do that, you respawn at the entrance of the thing. Actually, you could just warp out and... In order... You could just warp out and come back down here in order to activate the glitch. However... That's not speedrun tactics, <laughs> because there's a cutscene coming. No, wait, you need the cutscene, otherwise it won't work. So yeah, you have to die on the same frame as the boss. That way, this meat door, no, dirt door, is gonna be open. Then you can <laughs> kind of trigger this, play your sword as an ocarina or something, run back to the door using a s special path, and, well, it adds the doorway of this teleporter and the doorway ID of the actual door that there is up and that just happens to correspond to a door in the final dungeon. And the game also knows it needs to trigger a cutscene. So... <laughs> It triggers, basically, the cutscene to spawn the final boss. No! <sighs> A wicked man of the desert! I'm thinking of a good terrorist joke. <laughs> but I can't come up with anything. How about that's racist? Hmm. The sacred realm. Oh my. Interesting.
nice story, Mr. The Tree, but I'm not gonna believe it until I see some proof. <laughs> Religion, it's a thing. <laughs> Nah, of course this is a game and suspension of disbelief. It's a thing in the world of the video game. Oh no. Oh, don't worry, we aren't gonna grieve for you. You cut Silla so much. And it's only the third episode in. Hmm, the Princess of Destiny. Hmm. Yay, stones. It's shiny. I wonder if you have to view this cutscene in order to get the stone. Oh well. <clears throat> Treat Navi! Stupid tree, may you die a horrible, painful death. And my wishes were granted. Yay! Thanks for the fairy, by the way. I appreciate it. Really. <laughs> It's the first time someone made a let's play of that and laughed less than they could eat right. Oh well, it's a tree. Not gonna cry too much about it. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Let's Play Ocarina of Time. Or uh, Ocarina of Time. This is Legion and fare thee well.